Daddy in the car? <laughs> Mom, Mama's driving while Daddy eats and... Second time in our married history. <laughs> seven years married and Mama's gonna drive. Yeah! <laughs> He always drives. <laughs> we got a nice, beautiful chauffeur up there, Brendan. She is one hot chauffeur, yes, sir. <laughs> so, we are gonna attempt to go to a movie with the little one. <laughs> Let's see how it goes. It'll be interesting. What's the name of the movie? Jungle <laughs> Book. Jungle Book. <laughs> okay, here we go with a 17 month old. Wish yeah. us luck. <laughs> Are you ready for your first movie? Oh my goodness. Oh my. Here we go. Come on, let's go. Let's go, let's go. Oh, it smells so good. As soon as we got in, oh, this looks really cool. As soon as we came in, he sat right down, he laid his head back, and was captivated. <laughs> He's a movie fan. <laughs> and Mama got us here. Welcome early. to AMC. Let's talk safety. Keep track of any creatures or other belongings. Here we go. <laughs> you were so. Good. Oh my gosh, your first, first movie! movie. <laughs> he loved I can't it. believe it. He loved it. We wow. did great. Okay, so you're awake. Clap, clap, clap. You stayed awake. Clap, clap, clap. Through the previews, all the previews. <laughs> and then you fell asleep for what, an hour, hour and a half? He got a good nap. And then he woke up the last I couldn't sleep 20 then. minutes of the movie and he just sat there. I couldn't believe it. I thought we'd be in this hall right here most of the time. But he did really good. Mommy did great too. She held my hand. <laughs> <laughs> it's a great movie. You should yeah, go see it. It was a great movie. It was really yeah. good. I knew it would be. Now I'm excited that we can go to a movie now. I want to go. I'm excited to go yeah. next weekend. <laughs> oh boy. <laughs> See? We're laughing because... See, I'm bigger. Oh, yeah. It's because of the... <laughs> we filmed together. It looks like my head is bigger than his. <laughs> Maybe now, it is. is. Why is that? <laughs> <laughs> well, that was a success tonight. Who would have known it would have went that way? Really? We were just giving it a try, and it went really well. I was surprised. Pleasantly really? surprised. Had a relaxing movie. <laughs> 
<laughs> I'm looking at Brendan. He found the printer. There's a lot of buttons on there, huh, buddy? Yeah, he likes to press the buttons. He's excited about that. Well, that was a great movie. I it's loved so noisy. it. So noisy. Because we used to watch it when we were kids. Mm. Well, the cartoon version. And there was one part that I just, there was a lot of parts that I, I find meaning in movies. I, I can't go for three seconds without saying, oh, that's very meaningful and that has significance. And there was one part where if, if you go to the Jungle Book Sorry, trailer, you can see it. And it talks, uh, it's, it's when, uh, it's the snake scene. When uh, Mowgli, the little boy, is kind of lost out there in the jungle. And here's your ball, Brendan. Look, the ball that you were blessed with at the hotel, the resort. Anyway, the, um, the snake, or I should say the serpent, that's symbolic if you study the good book. Um, I'll say the, uh, the, the, another name for the serpent, the adversary, is the liar. The snake, Ka, uh, the this, this snake started from the very beginning lying, deceiving, and trying to very carefully, subtly trap and destroy little Mowgli. And I thought there was just the most powerful message when, at least it was to me, maybe I'm reading into it too deep, probably, but uh, I think I think too much, I think. Can you grab him because he keeps pressing him? Cute. You're lucky you're so cute. <laughs> you might get. <laughs> So anyway, the, so the, <laughs> your his feet stink. <laughs> not my feet. <laughs> <laughs> your feet stinky. Oh. Woo. <laughs> That's the beginning of stinky boy feet. <laughs> <laughs> oh, mommy's never had a boy. You have brothers. You should know some things. Oh here, yes. Mama. Mm -hmm. Yes, you know a lot of things. <laughs> I know. I'm just kidding. Mm -hmm. Okay, so the snake said. And you just got to see the, it, it's so good. The trailer's just almost as good as the movie. The snake said, yeah. I know who you are, and I know where you came from. Yeah. There's such meaning in that because I believe the adversary, or call it the, 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 the opposition, I believe knows exactly who we are. Um, and in my belief, I, I have a conviction that we are, I have a conviction that we are children of a loving, all-powerful God, our Creator. And the, uh, the adversary wants to undermine, wants to lie, wants to trick, deceive, and doesn't want us to remember that and know that. So here's a little quote. I'll end with this. I've, I've shared this before, I believe. It's from uh, one of the best books ever written. My friend Jack Canfield, who we're going to get to meet with here very soon. We're going to get to see him next weekend. Mm, Jack Canfield, The Success Principles. Thank you. Thank the you. beginning of Chapter 5, or Principle 5. <laughs> it's titled Believe in Yourself. And this is just one of my favorite quotes. I, I believe I've shared it before on the vlog, but uh, it's by Max Lucado. He said, and listen to this, Brendan. This is so true for you, my sweet love. You weren't an accident. You weren't mass produced. You aren't an assembly line product. You were deliberately, he's stuck. Do you need help? Yes, I need help. Okay. This is a 10 minute vlog to you. The quote by Max Lucado says, you, you weren't an accident. You weren't mass produced. You, you aren't an assembly line pro product. You were deliberately planned, specifically gifted, and lovingly positioned on earth by the master craftsman. I love it. It's true. Ow, 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 that's me. Thank you. Have a good night, everybody. Good night. Thanks or for being day. with us. And I'm glad he slept <laughs> through most of the movie because PG is like a PG-13. <laughs> I think some parts he it would have been way too scary for him, so I'm glad he slept. It was really, scary for mommy. <laughs> yeah. I don't really recommend it for a 17-month-old. So, glad he slept, but most of it, anyways.
so thanks for being with us we'll see you tomorrow bye, bye. good night